Well, this will be a quick video because I don't have much time to talk on this subject. Now, the dress was cute. The girl looked cute in the dress. But you have to understand one thing. This is high school. You only got one prom, and you want to look the best you can. I didn't think anything was wrong with the dress, but I could see how other people could be afraid. They could be scared and intimidated. Um, first of all, when they tried to put the thing around her waist, I would have let her go in as long as she kept it tied up around her waist, covering the midsection, and you know, at least up to her breast. I had no problem with that. Um, the dress did look cute. And on a 17 year old girl, I sort of think that they didn't give her enough respect in that piece too because in that little piece, the you know, it was like, it was like leaning on one side there. They could have had her fix it evenly. They pretty much showed what the people of the administration saw. In other words, looking at that piece of video I just saw, I can see how the average person would side with the school and saying it's inappropriate. But the fact that the young lady tried to accommodate to enjoy her night, that should have been taken into consideration. Because you pay a lot of money to go to the prom. Okay, you won't let me in, but let me cover this up then so I can go in and at least enjoy my night. No. By then, like the man said in the piece, someone calls the police because they probably see a young black person arguing with somebody else or two black people arguing, I don't know. But it seems like when people of color argue, the police are there quickly. Quickly. Like, snap. So, in saying what I just said, I would have let her go in. I would have let this young girl enjoy her prom. Because the person that di didn't let her in, that person didn't go to the prom. That person didn't have a prom. And if that person did have a prom, then that person knows how much that meant to that person. That's one point in time. It's not like she was a, a junior invited to a prom. You know, she was a senior. That's her final shot. This is her last big dance. And that was taken from her. If I was her, I wouldn't just take steps to get my money back. I'd take steps to get everything back from that night. My friends, I, it, we are all coming together. I want their money back. Uh, you know, I want all, everything. I want everything back. I want my money for the part of the limo. I want everything back. I even want the money that I was going to pay to go to dinner after the prom. I want that back. You know, I would have went bad. And I could see this young lady going bad. But you got one prom. This is it. What are you going to do? Oh, you're right. I'll go home. Change my clothes. Come back. She could have did that. She could have did a whole bunch of things. But these young people nowadays want to do what they want to do. She wanted to look good for her prom. She had a cute dress on, and that's her prerogative. She needed the opportunity to have her final prom. She was robbed because somebody didn't like the way she looked in the dress. She tried to accommodate and was pretty much told, you know what, too little, too late. You talk too much shit. Fuck it, take your black ass home. That's pretty, probably, probably, probably what happened. She probably nutted up to the point to where when she tried to accommodate, it was too bad. It's too late. You want to be nice now to get in? It's too late. And people think like that. People think, you know, and uh, yeah, I was a little mad before, but now we're going to fix this. Can I get in? No. You can't get in because you nutted up 20 minutes ago. You acted a fool 30 minutes ago. You can't get in because you got up in my face. So sometimes you got to bend, young person. To get in. You stand by your ground. You did what you were supposed to do to try to go to your prom. You failed in thinking from another person's perspective. She failed in getting the prom to get into the prom because of something she did. But best believe if she really wanted to get into the prom, she would have covered that whole top half of her body up so nobody could see her stomach because that's what it was. Probably some fat woman, scared. This, this girl, has got that nice hard stomach. 
and I'm just blowing out of proportion. She ain't getting in here. Fuck that. She just look. She just doing a little too much. She ain't getting in here with all that. And that's probably what happened. That could have happened too, because people are funny like that. People hate. So hopefully, that accommodate this young lady, because she ruined her prom. It's done. You leave the prom in handcuffs before getting in. There was no prom. Prom night disaster. Friends probably went in. Got their little move going. She, she didn't get in. Somebody saw her, saw her yelling at somebody. Called the police. It's the black one in the skimpy dress. The black one in the skimpy dress. That's what it was. It was her nutting up. That that cost her the prom. And that's sad. Because all she wanted to do was look cute for her prom. Nobody said what the prom date, how he felt. I'd be pissed. My girl can't get in. What? Can she wear my jacket? Can I put my jacket on my girl so she can get in here? Didn't even show his face. So, um, it's a sad, sad day at the prom. Next time. Both parties have to bend. Because you only got one prom night. You only got one shot to look your best. The last that anybody might even see you. And it was taken from her. Maybe because of jealousy. Maybe because of hate. Maybe because her mouth was too big. Maybe because she nutted up. But understand this. Missing the prom for 15 minutes of fame, priceless. You got to wear your prom gown around the world. National news. You made it. And that's more than anybody else can say at that prom. Their dresses wasn't seen all the way here in California. They didn't get to model their dresses like you did on the channel 3 news or whatever that is so don't be mad don't hate you got more out of that prom not getting in the prom than anybody else at the prom let this shit go and move on don't ask them for shit you got over 5,000 hits mm, sweating that's the work shirt on. Still worked hard today. Yeah, and you was cute in your dress. I just want you to know that. So, hey, you've been tubed. The system has been tubed. Should have let the girl in when she tried to cover up. She wouldn't be on YouTube right now. Being bounced all over the planet. See, she didn't get prom photos. She got prom video. Video video from the day after the prom that's bouncing all over the world. So instead of like, <laughs> I got her little black ass for talking shit to me. I got her. What you get was made her bigger than what she was. Now everybody has seen this cute girl in her dress. The same dress you wouldn't let her wear. How you feel for not letting her in the prom now? How you feel for sending her around the world in photo. You was too. Thank you.